Hi Aries, welcome to your quick Valentine's reading. Now let's take this is only for singles, okay? Now let's take a look. If you'll be finding the right one, you will you be dating the right one? Or will you be dating somebody that could actually last long? Now please take note that this is only a very quick reading, okay? This is not a full out reading. Let's take a look, Aries. You are trying to run away from somebody from the past. But then this person is actually going to be coming your way within the next four days or four weeks. Hmm. But you're going to be meeting somebody who's an earth sign around the next 14 days. There will be a change of... Mm. There will be a change of energy and there will be a change of fate. Now, let's take a look about your sex life. Oh. Okay. Okay, the thing here is you will be instead of paying attention to someone new, this person from the past that will be knocking on your door again, you will be giving him or her, okay, another chance and it seems like the thing that will be catching you or the thing that will be making you feel so enthralled again into this person's lap is because they've they're already um, successful and happy right now in their chosen endeavor. This person have run away or turned their back on you during those difficult times. And you didn't even know why they chose something else. It's not someone else. It's something else. Okay. It could be like a job or like an offer, a trip or something like that. Okay. But there's no third party that I've, that, you know, that I've seen here. And you were caught up or you were stuck in this person's um, memories and, uh, you know, and also the pain that this person have caused you. But you know to yourself that this is the one and only um, soulmate, okay? Or this is the only person that you ever want to be with because this is the only person who knows you so well, who, whom you can feel even at this point. And this person has an earth and a mixture of fire and air in them okay and you've tried to run away you've tried to look for someone else you've tried to move on tried to move forward been in and out of uh, different relationships but nobody compares to this person so the final moment will come into your life and you don't really have to worry too much whether it's going to work out or not or whether if this person will still be running away from you or not because this is the moment that you have been waiting where the you know where the wheels will start turning in for good and there will be a change of karma and change of um change of your fates okay um i feel like this time it will be for a long term it's just that you need to leave all those pains behind and, you know, leave it in the past. And in fact, that even though you are going to try to hold on to your pride and you're going to try and, you know, like, um, resist the charm of this person and not to have sex with them, him or her, okay? Uh, well, the thing here is you are going to be giving in, okay? And you will love because the feelings, the ecstasy, and the, uh, the satisfaction will be very different. And it seems like this person will be taking you into a lavish or luxurious place where you're going to be liking it, okay? And, well, during those times that you were together, you're like, you know, like doing it in a very simple area or even outside or even, you know, in a place where you don't really have to pay. But now, this time, this person can definitely afford and will be treating you like a very important person, okay? And... By the time that this person, because you know, you will be playing around a little bit and you will try to push this person away. And when this person feels like, okay, fine, you don't want me in your life again, then, yeah, okay, I'm going to walk away. 
And by the time that this person wants to walk away from you, you're the one who's going to be blocking their way and tell them that, where are you going? Again. Okay. So, this time when this person comes back into your life, it will be in for good. Now, let's take a look. What are the things that you have to learn in order for you to have a harmonious and balanced relationship with this person? Okay. Because if you like, they're very mature. They have gone through a lot and um, it seems like they finally made it themselves. So they're kind of uh, a little bit different. Okay. Retreat. Okay. Mm -hmm. Focus. Loyalty. Gratitude. Hmm. You better take a few steps back, you know. Um, it's not about taking a few steps back and accepting this person, but it's more like if you need to fight your own fears and you need to fight your own issues, okay? You also need to focus on whatever that is necessary at the moment or whatever that is needed, okay? For the two of you to, to live in harmony and for the two of you to really forgive, and that is actually what you really need to focus on. Forgiveness. Moving on and moving forward. And try to have an open mind. And this person will remain loyal to you. And you need to be thankful for whatever the universe will be giving you. Alright. So. Hmm. And I feel like this person, even if you have tried to move away from them before. It seems like they... I've never stopped thinking about you. Even though they've been a little bit in denial before and they never really expected that the two of you will still be seeing each other. It seems like this time it is finally, you know, it's finally on. It's, it's, it will be official as well. And I feel like he also tried to be with someone. He or she, okay, tried to be with someone twice but it both failed the other one is you know they just both settled just because that they needed somebody or they both needed each other then the other one is just very quick because um this person sensed that uh, they only want something from them so both of you feel the same way that nothing compares to you okay and the long wait is over the long search is also over because your happiness is finally going to be knocking on your door within the next four days or four weeks. All right. So anyway, that's it for you for this Valentine's single Aries. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live with the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. All right. Blessings to you.